To install Canvas upper doors on your Razor Trail and Trail S, follow these steps. Park the vehicle on a flat level surface, ensure the vehicle is in park, and remove the key. Begin by removing or opening the windshield and rear panel if equipped. Then, remove and retain the two pushpin rivets from the door trim. Then, remove the door trim fastener and pull the trim out to remove. Continue by removing the eight door panel fasteners and remove the panel from the door frame. Next, unzip the rear of the upper door cover. Then, insert the rear door frame inside the cover and zip closed. The cover will fit very tight around the frame. Use care not to damage or rip the cover. Before continuing, ensure the frame is properly fitted inside the cover and adjust as needed. Next, unzip the front of the upper door cover. Then, insert the door mounts through the holes in the bottom of the door cover. Then, beginning over the top corner, continue working the cover over the frame. The final corner will be extremely tight. An assistant and a strong trim tool can help aid in fitment. Use care not to damage the canvas. Next, align the hinge with its mounting location on the door frames. Ensure the hinge is fully inserted between the two frames and close the hinge until it snaps into place. Then insert the two provided nuts into the bottom of the hinge and secure with the two provided fasteners. A flathead screwdriver may be used to guide the nut while tightening the fastener. Torque the fasteners to specification. Before continuing, attach the hook and loop straps attached to the cover around both door frames. Next, align the upper canvas door with the lower door frame and ROPS assembly. Then, install the provided clamps at the openings in the canvas and secure to the ROPS assembly with the provided spacers. Do not torque the clamps at this time. Continue by aligning the lower canvas door mounts with the mounting holes in the door frame. Then, loosely install the two provided fasteners and washers through the mounting hole on the door and secure with the provided nut plates on the other side. Then, repeat this process for the other mount. Next, remove and retain the outermost fastener from the dashboard. Then, align the roll cage cover over the A-pillar joint while carefully pulling the fender outwards and twisting the front of the cover between the ROPS and fender. Then, reinstall the fastener and torque to specification. Next, open and close the door to check for interference. The upper door hinges should operate smoothly with the lower door frame hinges. Then, torque the clamp fasteners to specification. Small adjustments can be made to improve the upper door sealing against the roll cage by sliding the upper door forward or backwards on the lower mounting points. Adjust as needed and torque the fasteners to specification. Next, align the panel with the door frame and reinstall the previously removed door fasteners excluding the hole near the door handle. Continue by wrapping the upper door strap around to the inside and aligning with the final mounting hole. 
Then reinstall the last door panel fastener and torque all fasteners to specification. Next, align the provided door seal to the door panel and mark the mounting locations on the seal. Then, cut the door seal to size for each of the mounting locations. Install the seal on the panel and ensure it is fully seated. Then, repeat this entire process to install the other soft door. Finally, reinstall the windshield and rear panels as needed. For more information, see your authorized Polaris dealer or visit Polaris.com.